We're going to solve the equation for the given variable here, and we have p equals 2l plus 2w, and we want to solve for w, get w by itself. Now you might recognize this equation again. Um, it's a formula for the perimeter of a rectangle. All right, length and width, 2 times length, length plus 2 times the width equals the perimeter p. Okay, but we want to solve for w. So there's a few ways you can go about this, actually. We could subtract the 2 out of both sides, or we could maybe pull out a 2 and then divide it and, and deal with it there. So I'm going to solve it both ways, and we'll see how we both can, we can get to the answer that way. So first, let me, when we get 2w by itself, so or w by itself, but we're going to we see the addition here, so let's subtract 2l to both sides. And we have p minus 2l. Again, they are not like terms because they're not the same variable. Uh, equals 2w, okay? And now all I have to do is divide by 2, right? Because we have multiplication going on here. Divide by 2, make sure we divide to both parts, both parts here. The 2 cancels out, and we have w on the right side equals, well, p over 2 minus 2 over 2 cancel, and so we're left with l. So I'm kind of not showing all my steps here, but we can see that we have w equals um, p over 2 minus l. Uh, if you need to pause the video, that's a good time to pause it, maybe look, see the math work, right? Um, double check it yourself and see if you can get to that solution. So what about the other way? Well, we have, I'm going to rewrite it, P2L plus 2W. What's the other way we can solve this? Well, we can pull out a 2 as such. I notice there's a multiplication of 2 to both parts here, so I could pull it out, all right? And so now we have 2 times l plus w. Now notice we can easily get back to this equation right here if we distribute this 2 back to both parts, right? The 2 times l and then 2 times w. Make sure we would distribute that. But we're kind of like doing a reverse distribute. Okay? So I'm pulling out that 2. Well now I have multiplication. So now I'm going to do the opposite of multiplication. I can divide the 2 to both sides. Okay? The 2 cancels. And now I'm left with p over 2 equals L plus W. We we'll want have a positive L here, and we still want to get W by itself. That's our goal variable. So I would subtract an L to both sides. Okay. Well, the L's cancel. The positive L, negative L, they're gone. The W comes back down, and we're last uh, left with well P over two minus L. That's my L. Uh, uh, yeah, that's my L. Sorry. And well, p over 2 minus l, we leave it like this because, they, again, they are not like terms. And notice that we have the same equation as we did here. Now, of course, you can rewrite it if you wanted to, make it nice and neat, depends on how your teacher wants it, as such. Okay? Hope you found this video informative, and uh, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, and thanks for watching.